On our program, we cover the most exciting trends, the most engaging culture stories, inspiring hearts and minds. Have you heard of the 24 solar terms? It was ancient China's way of dividing a year by observing the sun's movements. The solar terms, which were reflections of the changes of seasons, climate, and phenology, acted almost like a guide to life. The Chinese would eat, work, and play accordingly to these time-telling concepts. The knowledge has been passed down for centuries, and its influence is still widely seen today. My co-host Julian Wahan takes us to meet a Chinese photographer who is an online sensation for his images inspired by the solar terms, and he's using food ingredients as props. How about that? The ancients divided the sun's circular motion into 12 parts and came up with the 12 horoscopes. The Chinese went even further and divided the ecliptic into 24 parts and came up with the 24 solar terms. And they've been passed down from generation to generation to help with agriculture production, daily routines from where we lived, how we dressed, how we traveled, and also what we ate. Cinnamon roll. And today we're going to visit a food photographer who's known for using local and seasonal ingredients to recreate pointed images of the 24 solar terms. Check this out. Look at this place. This is the set for the solar term rainwater. And you must be the photographer, my yeah. Hi, Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> this is amazing. How did you come up with this idea of representing the 24 solar terms with food? Uh, actually, when we shoot the solar term, we the solar term. We eat 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 the 你看比如说前面这个生菜生菜后面这个呢其实模仿的是房子底下的这个墙呢是南瓜上面那个是什么桂皮对我们这个拍的是雨水所以还从上面要下雨然后这样吧一会儿你帮我下雨真的我在这
the major snow is marked by an abundance of snow, and animals have already started to hibernate. And the only thing that you can make out are these snow-covered slopes and what looks like a house in the distance made of angelica root. This major snow solar term. Animals need to pack on as much energy as possible, and we also need to eat food that's very, very nutritious. And these snowflakes or coconut flakes won't do just the job. Wow! <laughs> wow! Bayon 是我们时尚马野团队用食物美学来传递中国美学文化的一个课题之一。那在接下来呢，也会去拍摄七十二后。那这个呢，也是时尚马野的呃使命，让中国美学引领世界。<笑>